Here's a quick tutorial on how to make a GIF animation on a MacBook. So I have a website open here that is displaying some waves and I want to capture this image, this motion, and use it on a problem set. To do a screen recording on a MacBook, one way is to use uh, QuickTime. So I'm going to open the launch pad and initiate QuickTime. I'm going to go up to File and then new screen recording. I am running screen recording right now to create this video. That's why I cannot click on it, but you would typically click on it. A menu appears toward the bottom of the screen. You would have a choice to be able to create images or screen recordings for part or all of the screen, and then just click record. Now I'm gonna launch iMovie so that I can bring the clip that I just made into there to be able to edit it down to the portion that I want. So I'm going to pull it in. It's saved to my desktop. And drop it. And then go about trimming it down just to the portion that I want to convert into the GIF. I'm going to do a little initial cropping to take the uh, image down to just the portion that includes what I want, which is the waves, and then hit return on the keyboard to be able to execute the crop. Now I'm going to select the portion of the video clip that I want to use. Once I find a place where I want to start or end, I'm going to click, I'm going to go to the modify, and I'm going to split the clip and delete the portions of the clip that I do not want to use. Once I'm happy with the portion of the video that I have trimmed, I'm going to click on the Projects button to take me back out. It'll initiate me to name the file and then come back out. I'll click on the three dots next to the video name and then I will download it to a file. It'll show me up in the upper right hand corner the downloading button so I'll know when the file is complete. Now I'll upload the file to easygif.com to convert it into a GIF animation. I'll select the file, click the upload button, wait for a few seconds, and there's my file. Now I want to convert it. Now I'm going to crop it into exactly the portion that I want, just the waves. Once I have that, I'll click crop. Now I'm going to optimize to save file size all the way to 200. And there it is, ready to save. So I click Save and Download it. I open the document where I want it, and I paste it right into there, and then resize it and place it where I want. And now I've got an animation inside my document.